Twas the night before the main, and all through the house. Rob left cheese on the floor. There looks like a mouse. Fuck off! Start though, yeah. right? He's got a bug. <laughs> What's next? You know what mine was. So that's gonna be well, that's gonna be the intro for the next vlog for sure. <laughs> I'm really too nervous to speak, but for some reason today, yeah, yeah. But ultimately, it's just another fucking poker tournament. Going into the main event, everyone's plan was to play day 1D generally. There were six starting days, and the last two were when Europeans could play, and they're better than Americans, so th those two were out of the question for everybody. C, the third day, was out of the question for everybody because that day two merged with the day ones of the Euros, if you follow. So it was, um, so the choices were only A, B, or D. I was just like, fuck it, I'm gonna play B because it's best for my schedule because Katie and my dad were visiting. I never thought I'd ever be able to play the main event. It was only three years ago that I was like telling Katie, like I wish that I can be a retired rich guy enough to blow 10K. Fucking shook. Hopefully our table's whack. I'm glad they're playing this track. Hello. Is this by us nine-handed play? Just fuck a poker tournament. Just a poker tournament. Chip set. That we've never gotten to touch these chips yet. And we're ready. Ready to make it to early day four is the pre is the premonition. We'll have a pile of greens and oranges, and then we'll make a horrible call off. But I'll still be happy with the results. <laughs> it's fucking crazy that I'm here. I can't believe it. I'm legit sweating. I'm legit fucking nervous. I forget where I parked. I want to sit in the fucking car for a minute. Your mother's a whore. It's not, it's not real. I just don't want to fucking punt today. Three hours later. We just busted. I punted. So unnecessary in the main. Hey guys, what's up? It's John Party here from Joker News. Um, we are here with 2019 Colossus final tableist Ryan DePaulo. Uh, Ryan, it's been a pretty tough uh, WSP for you so far. Um, how do you feel about today? <laughs> <laughs> Not good. Can, can you can you fill us in on you know what happened, what went wrong? Was there anything that went right? Yeah, well, today was my first main event ever live, and um, <clears throat> I didn't make it past day one uh, uh, because. I got pretty unlucky. I dodged bullets. I folded a lot of hands that were tough folds, but I needed to do. And then maybe I got a little spazzy in the end. I don't know. I'm very disappointed, heartbroken. Um, I'm not quite familiar with the main event, but uh, is it true that you could have just bought into day two and saved yourself the pain today? This is the, yeah, this is true. <laughs> I could have just bought into day two and not have to have my dad and Katie visiting while I don't have day two to look forward to the entire time. So it seems um, more or less just like a, a terrible decision uh, by Ryan to play today. Um, do you think... They should be banned? ...that the Europeans have... 
taken over <laughs> WSOP. <laughs> Thank yo, listen to this fucking hand. It was f seven five pocket sevens on seven five five. We had pocket sevens under the gun. We raised two people called whatever, and and the flop was like a dream flop. The flop comes. Five, five, seven. So we have the best possible, the second best possible hand. We do lose the pocket fives, but this is like amazing. We have a full house, right? So we bet, this guy calls, um, and then the turn turns a six. So now I'm hoping that he had a straight draw or that he has a five, like ace five. There's a million things that we, that we get value from. We bet big again, the guy calls. Now the pot's really big. Now the river is a jack of clubs. So, if he had a flush draw, we're gonna get paid, right? We beat all of these hands. We beat a straight, we beat a flush, we beat over pairs, if he has kings, if he has aces. We beat so much. We bet big, and then he raises. And now we only lose to literally two hands, pocket fives or pocket jacks. Those are the only hands we could possibly lose to. We still have to call his raise. In, the, in other scenarios, I'd re-raise all in, but it's the main event, so I was cautious. I just called, and I'm glad I did, because he had pocket jacks. Wow, that sounds terrible. Then. And there's more. There's more. I had to fold aces on king, 10, four, deuce, seven. When I bet, 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 and then he raised the river and it's just like easy snap fold, even though it's the discipline snap fold. I was like Phil Helmy today. I dodged bullets and spots and then I flopped the royal flush draw on jack, jack, 10, with two hearts. I had ace, queen of hearts. I raised. And then Jam turned and he had just pocket hands. He just had me dead. I was drawing a royal one out. Just to remind everyone at home, Phil Helmuth does have about seven final tables, two bracelets in the first month of this uh, WSOP. So, <laughs> but Ryan, it was great to talk to you. Um, there's still a lot of uh, a lot of game left. Um, us here at Joker News are wishing you the best of luck. And uh, thanks for being the inaugural interview on your network of Joker <laughs> News. Now, right? Thank you. Goodbye. So what I learned from playing the main event is that it's just another poker tournament. Um, I, I've gotten used to not amping them up so much. I mean, as I'm able to play more, it's less of a big devastation. I've been so lucky that it's like I'm not. I don't. I don't expect to win. Like I, I've had so much success, like with just being lucky in tournaments, that I don't feel entitled to. I can't complain for 13 more years. Is what my personal. Uh... So my plan this year has been 10 years in the making. Is I'm not going to bluff. Literally one time. I might see that bluff. No turn bluffs, no river bluffs. So I want to look as aggressive as possible. So I'm going to put like patch, 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 patch. They're going to be like super pro, probably bluffing every spot. But actually, and then the hair everywhere. I'm just trying to look like a skew track. You could do like uh Prodigy fire starter, like just two horns in the front. I would you fold to this guy on the river? <laughs> if you fucking call me on the river, you probably are right. Ask yourself this question: Would you fold to a river valley bet from this guy? Never. No. You no, wouldn't no. fold anything. You, you, well, no, him. I would never fold anything. You go five high. This guy's I, always bluffing. I call five high. Yeah, I mean, like this guy might even be on like some sort of Megan's Law list. Like, look at this yeah, guy. Yeah, I like, damn crazy. I look like okay. smack my bitch up. I can't fucking wait for the main. A uh, little known fact: uh, back up north where I live in Canada, they actually call me the main event. Um, so it's a little bit fitting. I'm playing down here in America. My first. Uh, my first main, um, like Tony Miles once said, feels like the universe is aligning for me. Oh, haha. Hi, I didn't <laughs> see you there. Uh, yes, oh, I'm excited. Yeah. That's all I should fucking fix. <laughs> I'm excited to play the main event today. I definitely was more nervous the first time I played. This is my second time, so I feel like a vet, even though I'm not. And uh, yeah, it's just kind of like another tournament for me. I mean, I don't know. It's, it's my 84th year <laughs> and I've never cashed. <laughs> I hope I don't go that long without cashing, but I feel really good. I've been managing my energy for like the last two weeks, just kind of all in preparation for this. So, I mean, it's just another poker tournament. It doesn't matter. They can just go out there and you play a little bit of this, you adjust your table. You know what I mean? Make some good plays, try to play your best. And whatever happens, happens. You know, if in seven, eight, 10 days, I'm a gazillionaire, it is what it is, you know?
gosh, man, there's an energy around it. Day one, everybody hopes are so high, my, myself included. Like $10,000, here you go. Like that's not a normal buy-in that we're playing. You kind of feel as soon as you sit down in that chair, you know, no matter how many chips are in front of you, you know that it was $10,000 to have these chips in front of you. It's not looking good so far. We've lost a chunk of our chips to Beiruzi over here. So we're trying to fight back. Long levels though, but you know, so we've got plenty of time. And maybe he'll let me win one pot or something, you know? Maybe. 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 He lost to the rooster, not to me. I didn't, lose. <laughs> I didn't win anything. <laughs> this was winning. <laughs> the battle of the... Of the the card protectors. Yeah. Going into main, I just wanted to make sure I was laser focused, and I was. Eighty-five k from sixty. So my plan is working. I'm not bluffing. And uh, yeah, they're all playing terrible. So it's easy. I can confirm. I'm playing terribly. Yeah. Just sitting here watching the punters pad playing the main event. <laughs> I've gotten everyone's name, I'm gonna talk to myself. Bob, Joe, Antonio, Shiva, Mike, Mike. Hold on, I know it's, it's Basil. Basil, fuck, I keep doing that to myself. Basil and Claudio. And Leah, the dealer, hello Leah. Great. How are great. you? I'm doing great. And it's a long day, so I'm gonna be super patient. Smile as much as I can. Enjoy myself. Texas is here to play, Murray. <laughs> <laughs> we're not fucking Kansas anymore. So we opened. We opened, no, we three bet jacks uh, in middle position. Uh, got three collars. Flop comes nine, eight, deuce, uh, two tone. Um, the guy from middle position leads. Um, I call, two collars behind. Goes flop, flop. Uh, I raise. Turn comes, no, turn comes eight. I bet. Uh, call, call. River goes check. I bet the guy behind me calls, and then he rips it, um, and he has top pair, and we folded jacks, and he bluffed our fucking face off. So now we have no face. <laughs> Doing good. Tell me how where you at. We got uh, we still got starting stocks. We're at 60k, which is we're very happy because we were down to 30. So. What's up, dog? Pleasure to meet you, bro. Me Pleasure. How you sitting? Where's the kid? Uh, oh, there's the kid. Yeah. There's the kid. What's up, buddy? What's up? What's up? Hello. Nice to finally meet you. Yeah, Hello. Hello. Good to see you again. Uh, this is our first time meeting. <laughs> <laughs> So me and John met two years ago when Online? I was here. On the internet? No, on, no, no. In Real a, life, face-to-face. Two, face. 200 daily deep stack and he doesn't remember because he was on the drink. Shit-faced. <laughs> Shit-faced. <laughs> Straight oh, digger. It was unbelievable. Uh, I got, I'm got. i still alive. Yeah. How about you? 70k. So, yeah. so I've got a good nice. table as well. Though. The old man's in the lead, obviously. You know. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, that's what happens when you get so overset. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, yeah, you got all right, let's not punt. Yeah. That's and I haven't, I literally haven't bluffed yet. It's the hardest thing for me not you know, the, No, I haven't bluffed yet. The, I literally chipped up the entire way just diving and making good calls. And then that hand happened. I'm just fucking off a little bit, you know what I mean? Tossing chips here, tossing chips there, having a laugh. You know me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you're your everyday 10K, yeah, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, like 10 extra biggest buy-in. Yeah, you know, literally, like, yeah. Yeah, ever. <laughs> I'm on like a uh, level 100 life tilt. I needed this break. Nah. But it's not, not even like poker tilts me, it's like the, like, people. Sometimes. 
Whatever. I'm, I'm over. <laughs> but I'm doing fine. I, have, I, I mean, I'm not doing fine. I have 40k. Big mine's 400, so I'm not really past 100. Miles, so. Father told me to repent. I had to trash my sins. I done did some things before. I never do again. I ain't mean to bring you down, but now I'm on.